Hey everybody, welcome back to Joe Wednesdays, a show where everything's made up and the points don't matter. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's not it, no. I, um, admittedly though, I, uh, I thought of that when I was eating dinner today and I had more of a laugh than I should have at it, but... <laughs> anyway, <laughs> pardon me. Anyway, uh, hi, welcome back to Joe Wednesdays, this is Jay Hobbs, how we doing everybody? Um, clearly I am in a funk, uh, or something, cause, um... Yeah, last week just kind of exploded on me as far as busyness, and uh, I'm a bit, I'm a bit worn out. So, uh, luckily we have my humorous side showing up today, cause, uh, cause yeah, I'm, dude, I am out of there this week. Um, so yeah, there was, um, let's see, thinking, thinking, yeah, there we go. Um, so I had one of my coworkers was out on vacation for the week. Uh, another coworker was out for about half the week. And basically, on days where both of them were gone, a lot of things started coming down the pike as far as what needed done at work. So, yay! It all came down on my shoulders to take care of. And um, yeah, so I was, I was working a lot of extra hours last week and uh, just uh, trying to trying to work extra on my projects because when I should have been working on my projects, I had to work on theirs because they had deadlines come up and that kind of thing. So it's like, okay. Um, <laughs> so that, we took that and then we added on top of it some kind of crazy news on, on Lydia's front because, um, you know, like we, we've generally kind of like, you know, dipped our toe in the water as far as like starting potty training with Lydia, but we haven't really given like a real focused effort on like really getting her to do it. Um, but I was talking to her teachers last week just to kind of ask for like, hey, how are things going? And um, and apparently, like, the one teacher who's not normally there in the afternoon I pick Lydia up, like, had, like, a whole report on Tadpole the next day. And, um, like, apparently, like, you know, Lydia had been, like, refusing to do potty stuff and saying no to stuff. And I was like, oh, God, no, she used to, I thought she was just doing that at home, not at school. Uh, so that was kind of disheartening news. And then to add on to that, they, they, uh, the teacher let me know that if they move, when they move up to the preschool level, um, they need to be fully potty trained. And I was like, oh God, like they, they're supposed to move out when they turn three and Lydia's birthday is only a month away. And it's like, oh God. Um, I found out that once they move up into the preschool, they, they move more by, uh, like school, uh, quarters instead of, um, like they, like kids don't age out like they did in toddler and, and, and the infant rooms. Um, but still that only that's only giving us until like August to get her potty trained and So so that realization on top of everything that was going on at work. I was like super stressed out about everything <laughs> um, So yeah, so I don't um, uh, Sorry, I'm kind of losing track of what I'm saying. Sorry guys. Um, so anyway, so point being with Lydia this this weekend was incredibly long and stressful because we were really trying to push her to get on the diaper changing stuff and we got her like we got her like trainer undies that have a little bit of a lining in them so that if they you know they get wet they're a little at least a little absorbent and that kind of stuff and um i mean obviously we were having accidents and stuff like that as that just kind of goes with the territory but um but yeah i think i think i was i was putting too much pressure on it so i think i need to first i need to get some rest <laughs> and then i need to kind of ease up on the gas a little bit i know there's a deadline and I know there's some kind of urgency about it, but that's not, it's not going to help Lydia learn how to do it if we're just stressing her about it. So, so I need to, I need to kind of, like I said, take a, take a breath, kind of pause, get some sleep sometime, hopefully. Um, but I'm really like, like, it's kind of disappointing me a little bit that work is taking up a lot of time from my evenings because I'm either kind of too worn out to do any video editing or I'm literally like having to take the time to actually work and when I would want to be editing because like I have I have these two kind of new bigger projects that I'm trying to work on and like I can't like you know I can't work on them if I'm if I'm uh if my time is dedicated elsewhere so um but you know one's almost done so maybe i can hopefully wrap up at least the editing today and we'll we'll see if i can get it out sometime this week hopefully for you guys to check out um 
But anyhow, yeah, I don't, like, like I said, I don't really have too much to say outside of that uh, because of my week being so busy. So I'm going to cut myself off here. Hope you guys are having a good week, uh, and we'll see you next time. Take care.